Yo, I believe that I, be, I have a thing where in my mind where I believe that um, this is this is totally off topic. This ain't about females or none of that. I believe that uh, that the that the planet is is um, protected by a certain force field, which we call the ozone layer. Which which is exactly why we see shooting stars. What we what we refer to as shooting stars. Um, what a shooting star is basically some sparkling ass shit that's falling off the sky that dis that that disintegrates before it even hits the fucking ground. So we, what we got to think about, if if you want to be logical, you got to think and ask yourself, hmm, what the hell made it disintegrate like that? You got to think because it, it started to burn and it just disintegrated within thin air. And it never hits the fucking ground. You know what I'm saying? If it does, it hits it in a much smaller size than which it came. Now, here's why I think that happened. I believe anything that is not of the earth, of the godly earth, that doesn't belong on the earth, if anything tries to trespass, it gets burnt from the ozone layer, our protection. And it would not make it. It would not survive. I don't think that anybody could go out of space. That's bullshit. Y'all believe that all that crazy NASA talk if y'all want to. I don't believe none of that out of space bullshit. You know what I'm saying? What I do believe is this though. Here it goes. I'm going to get a little deeper. I do believe in aliens. And I do believe that they're among us right now on this planet. Now you're going to be like, yo man, yo. How the fuck do aliens get here? How, how, how aliens get here? They can't get through the uh, ozone layer. Shut the fuck up. Hey, listen to this, man. God damn. What was God's first word in the Bible? Let there be light. Let that sink in for a minute. Because future technology, what I mean by future technology is the shit that we don't even know how to twerk with, tweak with today. Not us, us as the people. Yeah, I'm talking about us as the people. We don't know how to fuck with that as, as the people. But the government and other people who are in, in, in bed with the government, they have that technology right fucking now. I bet you that. You know what I'm saying? Te what technology you ask? Light carries a wave pattern. This is how CD players and DVD players work. That's why every CD you see in back of it is damn near like a mirror. It's a reflection. That's sorry, excuse me. That's just so the light can bounce off of it. Now let me tell you. Let me give you an example. My bad, I ate some damn cereal. <laughs> let me give you. Let me give you an example of what I mean. The the light hits the 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 spinning CD at an angle. Now nothing is no information is in this light, but when it hits the CD, the spinning CD, it's hitting ridges. It's hitting little ridges that we don't see. And now, the light that's bouncing off the CD is containing these ridges, information, and bringing it back down to be read in a panel. It's, um, uh, what you call that again? Um, solar panel. Okay? Let me give you a, a more basic logic. Record players. Sound is vibration. If I go like this, you hear crackling as a sound. Those are all different vibrations. Just speed it up, sped up. I'ma slow it down. You can, you can almost count the crackles. I'ma slow it down one more time. I'ma slow it down even more. Okay, you understand? Me speaking right now is nothing but, none other than the crackles and, and it's just super high speed. Those, that, those are vibrations. Now, on a record, on, on a vinyl, on a vinyl record, it has it has ridges on it. So when it turns, the needle it hits those ridges, and all those thin lines that you see is a swirl, which eventually going to end the, uh, cause the needle to end up in the middle, from the end of those uh, vinyl to the middle. It's never going to repeat. The same lane, that lane is a swirl, and it has it has ridges in the vinyls, 
which which causes a vibration which the re the needle reads and it plays it back in a speaker the speaker which vibrates back and forth back and forth at you if you look at it it's a paper wrapped around in the back of the paper's coils and it's a magnet causing that paper to bounce back and forth with sound so what I mean by what, so this is the concept of light having information because music plays through light. I have a video what I made. I might I'm I'm, I'm gonna put it in the back of this um I'm gonna put it in the back of this um uh video. You can just click on the um video and watch it. Well, I made sound. I, I didn't invent it. Now I just re, re, recreated it. I made sound play through light. Light lights carry sounds. But there's even there's even better technology that we don't know of <clears throat> where lights carry more than just sound it could carry physical physical information like this is how this is how they're starting to do teleportation you know what i mean it could it could carry it could um they could transport one atom from one side of the damn country to another side of the country they could uh teleport atom you know what I'm saying? If you don't know what atom is, is uh, I think it's two molecules. Two two molecules equal equals an atom, and those are the most tiniest things that, that form anything. We are made of atom. I believe the word atom came from Adam from the Bible. Adam and Eve. I believe Eve came from the word evil. Who uh, fuck knows? I don't know. It, it makes sense. But anyways, uh, so so what happened was the fallen angels that's within space. You know what I mean? which is aka the heavens they came through the ozone layer in the form of light and they entered the earth without getting burned they are the fallen angels written in your bibles an angel is none other than an alien the heavens is none other than above the clouds space and everything and beyond the heavens not of the earth Anunnaki one of the um, uh, the aliens the, the definition of Anunnaki is from from those from heaven to earth who came you know what I mean so hold on my phone ringing so shit ah uh, hold on wow I didn't pause the shit damn it yeah so what what uh, that's my little concept you know what I mean of why aliens uh, were able to were successfully uh, able to make it here and an asteroid cannot make it on this planet you know what I mean or anything else that's that's that doesn't have the technology to come in this planet cannot come to this planet we over here keep thinking that this shit is a fucking uh, science fiction about um, other existence other beings and uh, existence um, really existing it, it's it's true you know what I'm saying you know by times I look in the sky and I see weird things but that's another topic, all right? So just take that logic and run with it. The bread thing. By putting a sardine on a bread.